I'm an artist and producer and songwriter and I go by the artist name Prin. <laughs> Prin. <laughs> Funny because it's only our fourth or fifth gig as a band, um, but I feel like we have come so far. Like we, our growth has been kind of quite big in a short space of time, um, and just like the emotional roller coaster that I've been on from the beginning to now, and like my confidence growing and stuff. I feel like we've been performing for ages, and it's just kind of sad that this is going to be the last one for a while. Get a good part of it, like. That's it. Now I'm breaking everything. <laughs> That's it. Listen, mate, I've just got to be honest with you. I'm just like. <laughs> That's it. Now I'm really angry. I don't want you to That's embarrass it. yourself on stage. I'll be honest. Ah. Chris. Top priority, having fun. And connecting with each other. So eye contact. Three rehearsals back, like a week and a half ago, was kind of tricky because there was some outside circumstances that came into play, but um, we really pulled together and kind of like just tried to get as much as we could done, which was great. Um, a big part of that is like accepting if things go wrong, not dwelling on it or feeling like angry about it. Okay. Cool. Nice. Okay, guys, thank you so much. This is my band. This is my we're, last we're, song. We're good. We're good. Yeah, we've we got it. I actually yeah. ended up learning the song during the thousand. Like, you can hear it. Really? Yeah. Yes. Since I started performing, I had I I had like crippling performance anxiety. Like I used to um. I used to absolutely hate it. I would get up on stage and I would just be. I would I would literally feel like I was gonna faint. Go! Go! And that's been such a hard journey to overcome that. Um, but because of that, it just means that I have to be very vigorous with my routine and make sure that I'm doing the things that I know work for me, like my vocal warm up. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I just want to give it my all, um, but obviously, <laughs> you know, there's those little thoughts that come in, like those failure thoughts, like, you're going to fuck it up, it's going to be terrible, everyone's going to hate you, <laughs> you're going to get booed off the stage. I want for my music to be like consistently for my whole life is um, that it uplifts people. But if you jumped the edge and held your head out low, I don't know if I'd been brave enough to follow you. When push came to shove, we played out. Being in the music and 
being present in that and being present with my bandmates and everything it just it kind of feels like flying almost like it's really it feels like you've just jumped off a cliff and you've got wings and you just like you could plummet but you're like in it's like moment by moment by moment by moment you know because you're so focused